da 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 Now remember when I talked about gargoyles? Let me come back to that. Let me come back to gargoyles. Remember gargoyles? And I told you this was their first experiment in telling a story that would be uh that uh different audiences would would like the older teens would be able to start watching these cartoons, remember? And they brought in a very young writer and producer to tell this more adult story in their cartoons. And their experiment, they thought that experiment didn't work. But other studios kept, took the idea and kept going with a lot of success. And eventually Disney decided, well, let's go back and do it again. But this time we're going to use a story that every generation is familiar with. And that is Star Wars. And they brought back that writer to make a new series, just like he did for Gargoyles. But now that he's older, he's got more experience telling stories. He's got more experience in, in, the, in the TV industry, not movie industry, but the TV industry. And he's a huge fan of Star Wars, Dave Filoni. Let's bring him back and have him make this cartoon series. And that's what Star Wars Rebels is. It brings us back to full circle. Full circle. Star Wars Rebels is such a great series. It it helps a lot. It helps a lot if you're already a big Star Wars fan. And you've watched all the movies. So you know the the epic um myth of of Star Wars. You know it. And there was another cartoon series that takes place just before this one called The Clone Wars, which is another fantastic series. Dave Filoni was very responsible for that. He wrote a lot for that. But he was given complete control over Rebels. And it is such a fantastic series. Now, because it's Disney... And because they, are, they were very, very, very cautious, the first season is definitely for kids. Okay? The first season is for uh, fairly young children, six or seven years old, um, with a little bit of stuff in, in there for eight or nine-year-old kids. Season two is for those children who grew up a year. So those seven or eight-year-old kids are now um, nine and ten years old. They're a little bit older. They're able to follow a more complex story. And then seasons three, four, and five follow the same age. They're much more mature. They're much. More, they're not adult, but they're definitely for much older kids. Characters die. There's romance. There's mysteries. But there's no happy ending to the mysteries. Sometimes the mysteries are not answered. They're meant to be, we realize some of these mysteries, they're meant to be mysteries. Sometimes we don't have to have all the answers. Um, sometimes, sometimes our heroes make bad choices. And that's what Star Wars Rebels is about. And so these later seasons of the series are too complex for small children but it's the right material for junior high and high school. And did, did I watch this series? Absolutely. Every single episode, and I've watched it a couple times. And there you go. Star Wars Rebels. Man, I've been talking to myself, horse. I've been talking nonstop for how long? Uh, <laughs> I've got 45 minutes. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I've been talking nonstop for 45 minutes. I'm, I'm really tired. My voice is really, really sore. <clears throat> and I've been I've been I've been teaching all day, guys. I've been teaching all day. And then I've been talking nonstop for 45 minutes. But I'm really excited to talk about Disney cartoons on TV and finish with a really, really, really great one, Star Wars Rebels. And 
I really recommend all of these series, um, except for except for um, a couple. But you're not gonna see. You're not gonna be able to find those anyway. But you can still get Star Wars Rebels on Disney Plus. It's streaming now. Uh, Star Wars: The Clone Wars is streaming now. Ducktales is on there. Darkwing Duck is on there. Um, oh, you can you can find those on there. You can watch them on Disney streaming if you have Disney Plus. And otherwise, if you don't, um, uh, on the on Disney cable, uh, you can definitely watch these uh, these cartoons as well. So that is going to have to be the end.